Welcome back, survivors. Disturb Z here, and we are back in Imperion. Alright, a little, little lag there, but that's alright. Okay, so let me get up here. Hold on, let me see. Okay, I need to get... It's trying so hard. Ooh. Okay. Oh, there it is. Yeah, we'll come back for that. Whoa. I knew there was going to be something that shoots me in the back. It's always in the back. Always. Always <sighs> in the back. Quit hiding behind the body of your dead comrade. <sighs> That's the dead one. Yep, we're gonna hide behind the dead bodies. No, not the dermal burn. There we go. <laughs> they are not wanting me to go down inside this thing. Okay, I'm gonna wait just a second here and heal again. That way I can take down this turret. There we go. Oh, hold on. Reload. That was a close one. That most certainly was a close one. I thought I was going to die. I thought he was going to get me. But I missed. Oh man, I got a dermal burn. Hold on. I didn't even realize I had a dermal burn. Oh. <sighs> 
I knew there was going to be a thing somewhere. Where's it at? Where did I get shot from? Hold on. Let me get one more heal in. Really? How? Nothing was... I didn't have a... Is there like a residual heat burn effect or something that I don't know about? I didn't see one. Oh, uh, I know better than to do. Yeah, back to the tent. <laughs> back to the tent. Ah, uh, we were so close. Now we should be good to go. Slide that on back in there. And there we go. No! Uh, oh. We have acid rain. <laughs> It's like if it's not one thing, it's another. Something's trying to kill me here. Oh, such evilness. Such evilness. All right. Well, I guess we'll just take a look at some of this stuff since we got acid drain and we can't go anywhere. Uh, rocket launcher. Hey, armor boost. I need that. Titanium stuff. Windows. Why are there so many large windows in in the loot containers in this one. I don't understand. Was there like a lack of large windows or something? Okay, that just goes over there. Oh, do I see secrets? No, I can't pick it up. Ooh, optronic bridges. Ooh, tool turret. Oh, that's for an HV. Never mind. Never mind. There we go. Oh, did the rain stop? Yes, it did. All right. 
Well, now to go get the ship, and then I can grab all of the goodies, and we can continue. Yeah, that wasn't a bad PLI. It lacked a little bit on the inside as far as, like, number of rooms and, you know, the extent that we had to go through, but the number of bad guys in there is pretty high. Especially for its size, yeah. <laughs> that of those turrets, eh. I am not a fan of those little laser turrets. Those little laser sentries, whatever they call them. Whatever it was that killed me after I got away from the fire, yeah, that's... Not sure what happened there. I mean, I've seen them give, like, dermal burns and other stuff like that, but I didn't think think that I had one of those when I died. But I could be wrong. I might not have noticed it, but... that landed up here. Cozy. Gotta love getting that zass out of those turrets. Ooh, secret container. With more windows. Yeah, I'm going to have to... <laughs> I'm going to have to throw them in some sort of blueprint for something. Because, yeah, that's a lot of... That's a lot of windows. I don't have anything... Oh, let me just use a capital vessel to... Uh, to stockpile some stuff here. Yeah, go ahead and give me all of those... I might want to keep that. Okay. There we go. Yep, you're empty now.
Okay, now just out of curiosity, how much of this blows up if I flip the switch? Anything? <laughs> yep, always trying to take my goodies away from me. That's what they try to do. Alright, let me go grab the rest of those turrets real fast. Let's see, let me make sure I have... Ooh, yeah, we are kind of out of room, aren't we? Uh, give me that door... Give me what? What, 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 what? Um, that's an advanced multi-tool. Do I have an advanced multi-tool? I do have an advanced multi-tool. That's good. Let's see. You are for an HV, so I can drop you off. Don't need you. Pulse laser. I don't think I'm going to need the pulse laser, so let me drop that off. All right, guys. Hang on one second here. Okay, guys, sorry about that little interruption there. My still, yeah, okay, I'm still connected. Uh oh. Um. Disconnect. Haha, -ha, computer's mine. Okay, let me go ahead and throw that in to there. I, I really want to see what this does. 59 damage versus. Oh. That's not very much. 600 rate of fire. 600 rate of fire. So that's better than this. Current range 63. Damage multiplier per head 2.5. Oop, hold on. I'm clicking things. Stop clicking things. Uh, 2.5. Recoil 0.368. Recoil point. Yeah, this is an inferior weapon. Straight up an inferior weapon. So, yeah, I'm not even going to mess with that one. Okay, do we got... What do we got down here? We've got another turret. I just hurt myself. Okay, we got some more Zaskozium. We are getting a lot of Zaskozium alloy. Loving it. Loving it. We're going to be able to build, like, so many things. At least I hope we can build so many things. Ah, uh -huh, look at you. Look at you and your dirty self. We're going to get zoomed up on you. Look at those little beady eyes. Why is my gun not loaded? My gun is never loaded for some reason. Man, that was tough. Y'all can't tell me I wasn't hitting him in the head. Alright, so what is this made out of now? We've got hardened steel blocks, so I'll get more titanium and more uh, more steel if I take... Why am I not... Where... Jump. Thank you. Thank you very much. Alright, so we've got that. We've got basically a full load here. Uh, we can head back to the base now. Let's see. Where are we at? We're over here. Okay. Yeah, we ventured out a little ways. Most definitely. Oh, that reminds me. I need to move that auto miner. Um, yes, yes, yes. Y'all had told me I'll probably have to go empty first. But uh, I was told that depending on where the nuggets are, that if I move it around or the deposit, whatever it is, that I can actually get a higher, a higher percentage out of that deposit and yeah that's something that I would most definitely like to have is a higher uh, higher gather rate out of it there we go now we're fueled up now we are cooking so anyway uh, now that we've done that I am thinking looking thinking we've got to do something I need I need something more than what we've got um, I know I've talked about a CV I really need to get a CV really really need to just stop and get a CV 
but the thought of a slightly bigger, more versatile SV is also alluring. Um, and I was in there thinking that if I did do a bigger SV, you know, all I would really have to do is extend this one back, like maybe two blocks longer, and then I could fill in that gap, that ca the, the the cavity, the gap, the the hole, if you will, with. Uh, with containers and then of course I'd have to add in a little bit more thrust so that we could you know we could up our thrust a little bit but I think for the most part though that we would be we'd be fairly good uh, I actually thought maybe even making it slightly wider might might also help I don't know These are all things that I have stopped and considered. I mean, because if I if I start making them wider, then the drills in the front are going to become more and more useless as I go. Hmm. I don't know, guys. I do not know. I might. It's a thought. I, I really don't know because I'm I'm sitting here. I'm debating because I'm like, you know, if I had two mini gun turrets on the back, that would give me a lot of extra defense. I would shoot drones faster. I could, you know, I'd have that extra gun to protect me. But at the same time, I would still get, you know, one shotted out of the cockpit by a rocket. So that wouldn't do me no good. And as far as the storage goes, if I were to build a CV, even a small CV, I could hold so, so much more. I mean, just a couple, just a couple cargo extensions and I could literally hold, you know, two, three times what, what I could with a CV or a, an SV. So... Yeah, I really, 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 really want to do. Let's see, let me do this real fast. I really want to do the, uh... Oh, I guess I shouldn't. I got a bunch of mixed stuff in here. Hang on. I really should do the CV is what I'm thinking. got a little bit of a restroom, we've got a little bit of zass, I've gotten, uh, I've gotten flux coils, I mean, I've got 34 flux coils, i got 97 advanced electronics, um, so I have things, I really need to, ooh, we got a small optronic, see, I've got 11 of these small optronic bridges, I really need something here. Okay, let me throw this stuff into there. Toss that in there as well. Where is... There it goes. Go to the fridge. I'm gonna leave those in there just just because just because I can okay I'm gonna go add in that new armor defense uh, let's see, what does that do? Give me plus 75. My armor value is at 270. 345. There we go. Now we got a little bit of armor. Now we should be able to take a couple shots. So, now that we finally, finally got that, uh, yeah, I think, I think we'll be good now. So, <sighs> about time. So, anyway...
Let me see. Let me go. Let's go check on the garden. Ooh, we got veggies. Nice. We've got spice. And we don't have mushrooms yet. Okay, good. Good, good, good. So that is what I will do now. Is I'm going to come in here. No, it's not. Don't be silly. Okay, I need nutrient solution. What am I missing for nutrient solution? Stone dust. You're going to tell me I don't have any stone dust. Well, we can rectify that real quick. And there is some stone dust right there. Okay, so we've got that, and we were making we were making tomatoes, but the crop yield is four for eighty minutes. The pumpkins is eight for one hundred and forty five minutes, which is fifteen minutes under that. So technically, yeah, I needed to go with the pumpkin there, and we're gonna go for two more spice. So what I'll do is I'll end up taking that whole row of, well, where the tomato is. I'm going to put a pumpkin, and then I'm going to make another pumpkin, and then I will end up taking that tomato out and put a pumpkin right there. That way we have pumpkins growing instead because we get such a better yield off of pumpkins. At least I think we do. Let me double check stuff here. Four vegetables, 50 minutes, eight grain okay yeah that's grain uh four vegetables four vegetables 80 145 oh no i looked at the wrong spot yield yield there's 10 yield. there's two ew, two yield yeah yeah we'll stick with the we'll stick with the pumpkins we will stick with the pumpkins Oh, yeah, they give us two each time we make one. That's right. I forgot. Um, I guess I should let that one finish, huh? Come on. There you go. All right, let me grab those, and I will grab that. We'll come over here. First off, you know what? I'm just going to put the pumpkins over here. That way I don't have to uproot uproot that guy. And I'm going to put two spice over here. There we go. So we've got two rows of spice. One row of mushrooms. We have two pumpkins. We have a tomato. And then we have three of the uh, aloe. So yeah, we should get we should get a pretty good yield and I think the next time we get a yield I'll go ahead and make another pumpkin. If I can make two more pumpkins, that'd give me four. I'll put one there, one there, and then I'll take the tomato out and then replace those two with pumpkins as well. So yeah, that'd be good. That would most definitely be good because then I'd have a nice big influx of veggies and all of the uh, all the plant protein that I've been collecting. Why is this in my fridge? Uh, you know what? I don't even I don't even want to know. Don't even want to know how it got in there. It got in there somehow. I must have been in a rush and put it in there. I like I like my flux coils cold. We keep those cold. So, but anyway, ah, <laughs> uh, that's gonna do it for today's video, guys. I do hope everybody has enjoyed it. If you have, be sure to hit that like button. And if you haven't already, do me a favor, hit that subscribe button. It is an awesome, awesome, awesome way for you to show your support to me, to the channel, to the video, and to the game itself. And as always, feel free to share the video on any social media you're using. And guys, just like to stop, take a moment, and thank each and every one of y'all for all of your wonderful, awesome support. All the comments, all the likes, all the subscribers, and all the videos shared. It is awesome. I do appreciate it. And with that being said, until next time, survivors. 
keep on surviving.